when do you metaphorically slam on the brakes and say, hmm, that would be a neat thing to take a little better look at. And especially if it's not something with a monument and a tourist attraction and where you buy a ticket and all that, but just something out in the middle of nowhere, which is what this was. Of course, I love the light glancing across that rock. Once more, one of my favorite geologies are the granite outcrops, the big granite domes or copies. There was a fig tree growing up there and it was catching glancing light as well. And luckily it had no leaves on it. If it had leaves on it, it would have kind of wrecked it as far as I'm concerned. And I just liked the way the light was kissing the highlights of the rock on the right. And then uh, just for the fun of it, I threw in a leopard. So I don't know whether right away everybody saw there's a leopard in there. But um, very often I have something hidden and concealed in, I mean, some wildlife concealed in a painting, which is of course normally what wildlife is. Wildlife is normally concealed. And I think it goes without saying, those of us that are out in the wilderness looking around at wildlife and paying attention to it, wildlife sees us probably twice as often as we see the wild, as we see wildlife, and maybe even more. And so it's uh, lurking up there in that crevice in the rock.